It's one of those hard to talk about topics, but coming up next on Moms Every Day, we'll find out why you should engage in a conversation with your doctor about your sexual health. Stay tuned. Today on Moms Every Day, we are at the Lure Laser and Medical Spa talking with Dr. Deanne Strobel about something that really very few people are comfortable talking about, and that is sexual health. Right. It's even uncomfortable for doctors, isn't it? A lot of doctors are embarrassed to talk about it, and a lot of patients even more so. Um, sometimes in a couple, one person's more comfortable talking about it than others, mm -hmm. and if one person in a couple has a problem, then the couple has a problem. So really this is something to discuss with your doctor, but if your doctor is uncomfortable, find another doctor? Well, you may be an additional doctor. Okay, right. so perhaps start with your OB-GYN. OB-GYNs are very comfortable talking about sexual health with women. Mm -hmm. The problem comes in if the partner doesn't have anyone they can speak to about their concerns. Okay, when broaching this subject with your physician, first of all, let me back up just a little bit. What would give you reason to broach the subject with your physician? Well, there are a wide variety of problems that can affect sexuality. So with men, mm -hmm. the thing you hear on TV all the time is ED. Of course. So all of the commercials for all the different drugs, but that's not the only problem. Mm -hmm. Some men don't have problems with that, but rather have problems with desire or other issues. And then women, the most common issue is a lack of desire, especially mm -hmm. as hormones start to decline but also pain. Uh, a lot of women experience significant dryness and changes in, in the genital area that make, make sexuality just very uncomfortable. So how do you broach this subject with your physician when you really want an answer that's more than this comes with your age? Well, you might just say, uh, mention to the nurse or the physician when you're going to the doctor that day what issues you are having and if they would be able to help you. And if not, find someone that would be able to help you more specifically with that concern. So bottom line, is there a way to help almost everything we've talked about? There is, and over the years, I have been so accustomed to treating women mm -hmm. that a few years ago, a lot of the wives would ask me, can you help my husband? And mm -hmm. so w we work alongside a lot of other doctors and we try to help the men as well. Sounds great. Dr. Strobel, thank you so much for the information. Appreciate it. I'm Ellen Sacco. Be sure to check out our website, momseveryday.com slash Texoma.